Good morning, I'm your South Florida lawyer, Patrick McGee, and I am your best friend at your worst time. Coming to you again from criminal court today, talking about the Fourth Amendment, motions to suppress, all that fun search and seizure stuff. It's interesting stuff. There's a lot of case law behind the Fourth Amendment, and for attorneys, it's kind of interesting to read the development of the Fourth Amendment over time. But it all comes down to when the cops can and can't search your car. A lot of attorneys do videos on the Fourth Amendment. There's been a couple good ones that came out in the last week or so that I've watched, and they provide a lot of information, a lot of analysis, and they're great videos. But that's not going to help you. When you're on the side of the road or you're in your car and the cops are pointing the light in your face and they're going, hey, can we search your car? And you're sitting there, you're not going to remember what's in that video. So I'm going to give you a great tip, a great criminal defense tip. The answer to any request to search whether it's your house, your car, your backpack, your pocket, anything, is always no. That's all you need to know about the Fourth Amendment. No, you can't search and then fill in the blank. That is the answer every time when a police officer or any law enforcement agent asks to search something.